Boom, boom. I won, I won. Mason, I need you to tone it down, okay? This is not the time or the place for that. Final warning. Hi. Merry Christmas, sir. Hi, sweetie. Son, go. go make friends with him. No, I'm okay. Come on, son. He looks like a good kid. No. He doesn't look like a nice kid. He looks like a little spoiled brat. I could tell. You're a kid, right? Yeah, you probably can sense it too. But you listen here. Don't you ever be a little jerk like him. Merry Christmas, sir. Merry Christmas to you and your little precious boy. Oh, he looks so sweet. Merry Christmas. I guess you heard him, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. My hands are dirty, I'm sorry. It's okay. Mine's are dirty also. That makes two of us. It's nice to meet you, my name is Jess. My name is Anna, and this is my son, Dustin. If you need any help, I would love to assist you. Um, actually, that would be great. I can pay you, but I'm sorry, I don't have much. Nice to meet you, Jesse. You and my son are close to the same age. Would you like me to introduce you to him? Yes. Come on, Mason. Come over here. I would like you to meet somebody. All right, Dustin, this is Mason. Mason, this is Dustin. Nice to meet you. Want to play on my Game Boy? Yes. Ugh. It's so sweet. Makes me want to puke. Wow. Look, that's just how Mr. Johnson is. <laughs> We call him Mr. Grinch. <laughs> he hates Christmas, but he loves the meals. <laughs> you can't take any offense to him. <laughs> None taken. <laughs> no, you won, dude. You're way smarter than me. Okay, since you can't listen, it's mine now. Oh, Mom, please. What are me and my new little brother gonna do now? Blah! Disgusting! Come on, boys. We can use your help. Merry Christmas, thank you guys for coming. Thank you. Bye, Mr. Johnson. Bye, Mr. Johnson. <laughs> Come on. All right, that was the last of it. <sighs> Thanks for helping, boys. Does that mean I can get my Game Boy back now? In a minute, let me talk to Miss Anna first. So, tell me your story. Well, you want the good or the bad? Both. Come on, Dustin, there'll be a while. You're really cool. Do you like me being your new big brother? Yeah. You? Yeah, I've always wanted one. Me too. Since I'm your new big brother now, I have to get a gift for you. What do you want? A, I want a horse, a house, and a Game Boy. Dude, a horse, a house, and a Game Boy? I'm gonna have to get a job. I'm only eight. Dude. Merry Christmas. Now all I have left is a house and a horse. What do you want for Christmas? I already got it. I sent it for a, for a new little brother. I just didn't know that they were so expensive. I can't believe that. Quick, hide it. All right, come on, Mason. We're gonna take Miss Anna and Dustin to our Airbnb. No one should ever live in a shelter or live on the streets. Like, you aren't feeling well. What did they expect? Wait, so they're gonna live in our other house? Yes. Well, thank God. Now I just have to worry about the horse part. What? Nothing. Come on, boys, let's go. Oh, what, what type of person do you want? <laughs> the 
moral of the story is, we are all God's children. If God is leading you to help someone, don't second guess it. You may be someone answered prayer. No one is born hating another person because of the color of their skin, his background, or his religion. People must learn to hate. If you can learn to hate, then you can be taught to love. Out of love comes naturally to the human heart, then it's opposite. Nelson Mandela.